So we all know and love Glossier, and if you follow the brand on social media, you will remember that back in January, they released this Instagram shot of Beyonce. Now, they teased that they were releasing a new product and she was wearing the product, but they did not say what the product was. Now we finally know the product was Glossier Lidstar, their first ever eyeshadow. Glossier was so smart with the release of this product. So they released it at the Oscars where it debuted on at least five or more lids on the red carpet. Now their product is a cream eyeshadow, it comes in a little tube, it's got a doe foot applicator and it's meant to just give you a wash of shimmer over the eye. There are some light natural colours and a few darker colours as well. If you live in Australia, us Aussies do not have access to the product because Glossier do not yet ship to Australia. However, I have managed to find three dupes for Glossier Lidstar and I'm going to share them with you right now. So first up is the Revlon Colorstay Cream Eyeshadow in Cherry Blossom. Now this is a dupe for Glossier Lidstar in Slip. Now I'm going to do these swatches on the back of my hand, which I wouldn't normally do, but I had a bit of a tanning mishap. And as you can see, we would not be able to truly see the result of the product on this arm. This is the Revlon Cherry Blossom Cream Eyeshadow. Next up, we have the MARC 18 Hour Artist Eyeshadow Ink in Gold Gleam. Now this is a dupe for Glossier Lidstar in Moon. Um, so Moon is just a muted champagne. And finally, we have the Stilla Shimmer and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow in La Douce. And this is a dupe for Lidstar in the shade Herb. So let's see how these dupes look on. I'm going to start with the Revlon Colorstay in Cherry Blossom. I'm just going to start with my fingers because I think that that is the best way to apply cream eyeshadows. Okay, so this is the dupe for Glossier Lid Star in the color Slip. Next up, I'm going to try the Mark Beauty dupe in Gold Gleam. Now, this actually works really pretty with the Revlon color, so I'm just going to use it. Since it's such a light color, this looks really beautiful in that inner corner of the eye and kind of like a highlight shade, so I'm just going to use it in the first half of my eye and I think it'll be a really beautiful look and it will transition really well with the pale pink color. I've got the Gold Gleam here and then the what I had on from the Cherry Blossom Revlon shade that is just here and it's just created this really beautiful ombre lid and it's really pretty as you can see. And next up I'm going to try the Stilla product in La Douce. Now this is a much more dramatic look um, and it is a dupe for Lid Star in Herb. I would just go straight on the eyelid with the applicator and use my fingers to blend it out. This shadow is a bit wetter in the formula than the other ones, so you'll want to be a bit quicker. Okay, so there you go. Now I've done a bit of a winged eye shape with this and gone a little bit bolder in the shape than I usually would, but that's just to show you guys the kind of effect that you can have with this. And there you have it. So until Glossier starts shipping to Australia, you can definitely get the same result with these products. And I hope you guys liked this video. And let us know in the comments below if there are any other products that you would like us to find dupes for. Thanks for watching.